All right, um, this is looking like uh, really good, clean work on this. Um, I'm just looking at all the different pieces. This is one where I might, um, when I bevel, I wouldn't, so it's not a big deal, but I wouldn't select these interior edges. Um, so go see how it like triples those. You don't really need those. Um, so what I would tend to do, like if we wanted to get rid of that, I can go Control A uh, for Attribute Editor, and then click on Poly Bevel, and then click the Select button, and then hit Delete, and then it takes it off. And then um, let me just isolate this. This button right here is Isolate Selection, which makes it easier to get everything else out of the way. And then I'll go to the top view. I'm going to hold down my hot box, click on the center, go over to top view, F for frame selected, right mouse click edge, and then select all of these. But then I'll hold down the control key and marquee select these inside ones. And see how I deselected those? Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, well, what happened to my selection? There we go. I just undid that. So see how... I don't have um, the uh, um, those selected, and then I'm going to hold down Control again and just click and drag there and get rid of those. And then I have only the edges that needed to be bevel selected, as opposed to all of them. Then I'll hit Control B for bevel. Let me add a segment or two. Can adjust the fraction a little bit. And so, and so you just get a cleaner model. Like you don't have those tripled edges where you don't need them. Not a big deal, but um, yeah, for something like this, I might go to add a segment or two to just make that look nice. Um, but uh, these are just really small details. I think you've done a really great job. Um, I noticed also that you uh, did a really nice clean outline or everything's organized and named there. Uh, the only thing I would say now is if you wanted to kind of take it further. So looking at the reference, if you wanted kind of to go beyond the lesson and add, you know, these sort of seams or any other, these hinges or any other little details that you wanted to flesh it out with or you know you can gather some other reference and see what it looks like on the back and that kind of thing but that would just be you know kind of above and beyond if you wanted to do more but this looks really good